Welcome to Portobello Film Festival. It's Tuesday today and we're going to Molly Parkin's exhibition. Come on, Ray. <laughs> Well, my old dad always told me that you can't go wrong with a Welsh girl, and today we got one of the very best Welsh girls, Molly Parkin, my old mate. Molly, what are you doing in here today? It's my private view of, of my uh, exhibition of painting. I pour all my passions into my painting now, and that is paying off like it used to before I gave up painting, like 36 years ago or whatever, in the 60s. for all that time, did you? No, I was fashion editor of uh, Lover, Harper's, The Sunday Times, I'd opened my own boutique, and so I was in fashion for 10 years, and then I wrote comic erotic, 10 novels for the next 10 years. Then I went on stage and traveled nationally with my one woman show, including chapter in Cardiff and somewhere else in Cardiff. Um, and then I collapsed with the drink. Yeah. What do you remember of this area when you were, you know, years well, I ago? I used to live here, actually, just around the corner up the road. But, you know, this area, when we were living there, uh, was a hotbed of fascist politics because that's where my father's idol, my father's very deeply anti-Semitic, and he joined uh, Oswald Mosley, and in these uh, depleted um, and decaying roads around here, utmost poverty, with a lot of immigrants yeah. and on the bread line, you know, so his politics festered here, you know, and he had big, big... Uh, uh, he had a big, big following here because my mother said, if we got another one of those fucking men goose-stepping up the front path, <laughs> in, all in black, mind, we are all in black. Uh, I, I'm moving, I'm taking the kids and going back to Wales. So he had to give up these fascist policies, my father. Mama, 